Here we have a species, and this is not your normal uh, mushroom shape, uh, but this is a species called Auricula cornea, uh, commonly known as woodier. Uh, and so this is growing, it's rotting the wood of this tree, of this dead tree here. And if you look up, you might be able to see this thing is absolutely covered uh, in this. And so the individual mushroom itself is kind of a sort of a texture of an ear, hence the name. Uh, and it sticks out sideways like this. And it's not very obvious where the spores come from. There's no gills and there's no pores like a normal mushroom. But on this undersurface here, this is the hymenium. And so there's basidia that are making basidia spores. So the spores are being dropped out uh, like this. So being up in an elevated position on the tree means the spores can fall down and disperse. Now this, uh, this species uh, has an important role in New Zealand's economic history because uh, back about, what, 150, 160 years ago when we were clear felling the forests, uh, enormous numbers of these things grew on the cut down trees. And these are an edible species. Um, they're used a lot in Asian cuisine. And back in those days, people didn't know how to cultivate them uh, commercially. And so New Zealand actually exported uh, tons of these things uh, to China. And it was a uh, major export earner for New Zealand uh, around that kind of early, early colonial period.